the options. Big respect for it's you to finding the it's time. Huge in yeah. This game. But all right, and we're seeing. Speaking good. of options, uh, Pikachu not good against Ness. Really? Yeah. That's a, that's a bad matchup. Well, for one big reason, and that's he can't abuse Thunder Jolt like he can in every other matchup. Ah, that's very true. We saw the T Jolts coming out early, but yeah, Ness only at 14% here. Now the one big thing is that Pikachu can body Ness off stage mm -hmm. consistently. Uh, if Mizik can keep keep getting Flux off stage, uh, I mean, what can Flux really do? Right, uh, just in general, yeah, like Ness is kind of vulnerable out there. You got to throw out that up B and, you know, it takes time for the the Thunder to come back around and knock you over. But, um, yeah, it's one of those things where you don't use Ness unless you're really good at doing yeah. that. So, like, you don't bring that you out in Xanadu. So well. Like, yeah, like, unless you're actually very good at doing that. And then um, is Ness's usual uh, ledge trapping or edge guarding going to work using the yo-yo against Pikachu yes. with that teleport? It still works? Still works. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Um, if you're ever playing a Ness or Lucas, uh, if you're on a platform stage, which all tournament stages are, uh, yeah, do not recover low because you're going to run into a yo-yo and you're just you're going to have a bad Ooh. time. And the sweet spot on that back air, it's my so goodness. Tough. There you go. Very reminiscent of uh, Zelda's lightning kick, I believe. Just a sweet spot that does an extra 200% knockback. Well, let's not compare it to Zelda. Zelda <laughs> is just nasty. But anyway, okay, so yeah, uh, Mizik down early, but, you know, there's no reason to panic. You've got Ness at kill percentage. Just play your game. No need to do anything that's too hard of a commit and allow uh, extra credit damage to be built I up. I like her spacing. She's just right. trying to wall him out. Not I, get over aggressive. Right. And you saw it on that nair. Like, she hit shield, and she instantly just drifted away and then came back with a forward air yeah. and knocked Flux even further off. And that grab. She needs to go out kill here. yet. Uh, so, no. She wants to play the ledge game. No edge guarding or ledge me. trapping from Pikachu. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I do the same thing sometimes. I just don't want to risk going out there and doing something stupid nice. when I feel like I'm winning neutral. So, you know, just let that person get back on stage. Oh, wow, she's going to go completely underneath smart. the stage. That's actually I huge. like that. That was swaggy. Yeah. Oh, and she <laughs> she actually takes Ooh. stage control Ooh. off of that. Tech. Ooh. Oh, well, at a low it enough percentage that the tech uh, didn't really matter at that point. It didn't Here send her at a nasty angle. Right, yeah. Yeah, yeah Town and City and Smash are both weird because their platforms aren't, like, as deep as Final yeah. Destination or Battlefield, so yeah, you get different uh, you get different bounces off of there. But like I said, she got hit with that up B, but at such a low percentage, it wasn't going to kill her yet, even if she missed the tech. But there, yeah, like I said, didn't panic after losing that first stock, and now you're both down at two stocks, and you're only 50% behind. That's not impossible at all for Pikachu. It's really nice. There you go. The, the quick dart back on the recovery is so good, like getting multiple hits off of that. Like a lot of recoveries have hitboxes, but to have a recovery hitbox that zooms through your opponent so it's probably safe is just such a huge advantage. Well, <laughs> not completely safe. Oh, really? No, not at all. Oh, okay. I mean, if, if you land right in front of your opponent after shielding it, you're going to get oh, wrecked. You're just, you're but the best Pikachus are able to constantly keep themselves out of that danger zone. Okay. And we saw a good PK fire to yo-yo conversion yeah. from Flux there, taking. Uh, Used to get him off stage, yeah. Good aggressive. It's so, so tough Ness, to deal yeah. with that. Ness is such a light floaty character. Like the way he kind of like bypasses the ledge to throw out that hitbox on that fair. Uh, really annoying to deal with. You just got to be patient and shield it. Yep. Oh, wow! And he yeah. got up right into that. Let me tell you that. about that. That is so active. It's <laughs> actually pretty consistent. If you catch the. Uh, I guess I would just be regular get up. I mean, yeah, like You're it has it has constantly. a lot of it has a lot of hit frames, a lot of hit frames on it, and yeah, you don't get that many uh, neutral get up. Like you are invincible for a little bit, but it's not going to outlast Pikachu's forward smash. Yep. Oh, I like that. Oh. I like that. You can really tr uh, trick people with that. On Strong those back throw doesn't kill yet. Pikachu having a hard time getting back on stage. Let's see, Ness dashing out and getting a grab. One more back throw will probably take him. Yeah, um, Ness and Lucas so both those really, really strong throws. Yeah, see, that's the problem. She can't just spam. So that's what you were talking about, right? So you throw out the T-Jolt, and really at such a long range, Flux has plenty of time to react with his down B and uh, take in some free health. But again, both players are on last stock, so it's not like it's the end of the world for Mizzix. She can very easily get a couple of good strings and, uh, and take this game over and steal game one here. Good Thunder? grab. Ooh. Oh, good air oh, dodge from the Flux, but then the up B, that recovery, very aggressive with it, gets a hit. Gets back on stage. Pikachu with stage control. Another grab. Is Thunder going to kill? Oh, 
Was that a miss? Was no, the first hit of Thunder hit. It didn't hit the second hit, which is the big damage. Knocks uh, you back. Okay. The first hit's just the spike. Sends you down. Got you. You can still get this there here, right go. here. Good dash attack. Ooh. Oh, very so aggressive play from Flux. Pair. Yeah. Those uh, those psychic disjoints. Does Doesn't go, go for it. For it. Oh, oh good speed. Yeah. Dashes away from the yo-yo. Comes in for the dash attack. Gets the kill. All right, so... Um, but Flux, at this point, kind of similar to what happened to him last game. He went down in game one and ended up making a character switch and running back games two and three. We'll see if he decides to switch again here and go with a Sonic. Uh, what do you think would be a better matchup against Pikachu, Sonic, or oh, Ness, Ness Lucas? Ness, Ness for, absolutely. Without a doubt. Okay. The so. fact, to be honest, he wasn't utilizing the down B that much the entire game. Right, you saw it at the very end. Yeah. But yeah. He was uh, getting T-jolted constantly. If I'm him, I'm sitting back in my shield, waiting for her to keep T-jolting, keep T-jolting. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna down B. There you go. There you go, just taking take the free health. Uh, we'll see, I'm not sure what's being debated at this point. Uh, what Omega form they're gonna go for. I would be absolutely fine with that. Give me colorful backgrounds and new music. Well, he better not take him to FD. <laughs> That's awful. That's Pikachu Playground right there. There you go. Uh, yeah, so Pikachu is really strong when um, there aren't platforms, so get in the way of their T jolts. Um, yeah, like you go to Battlefield, your T jolt accidentally hits a platform, it just wraps around, and if your opponent's Plus on your the ground. Plus, your combo game's nasty yeah. on that. So right, yeah. I Did I see PS2? So after striking and not going to PS2 in game one, we're actually going to see PS2 in game two. I think that's uh, a good stage because Ness wants space. Okay. All right, I, I'm positive Flux is just going to continue to troll us. He has two characters. He's got Ness Lucas and then Sonic. Well, they got second key three. Is he Sonic? Yeah. I've never seen him play Sonic. You played his Sonic before. Did I? Yes. Oh, boy. <laughs> and Shows yeah, what yeah. I know. Trolling, trolling with hanging out over Hero. Would have been hype, but, yeah, he's going to go with Lucas. He was actually – he was Ness last game. Yeah, right. Yeah, okay. I said goes uh, Ness Lucas. Okay, well, there you go. So maybe to mix mess with people's heads. I would go. do that. He foregoes the Sonic. So what is it that's so different between L Ness and Lucas that they're not Echo Fighters, that they're own independent characters? Oh, I have no idea. Oh, okay, so <laughs> I think they're. Not, I believe. Well, for, for first of all, PK Thunder comes outwards instead of down to the ground, okay. like he's doing right now. That's true. And then you have PK Freeze versus PK Flash. Okay, yeah. I got you. There are little differences. Uh, and I think their normals are completely different. They got oh, a lot okay. of differences. They're like, it's like calling Fox and Wolf the <laughs> same. Oh, okay, I right? got you. So similar, but yeah. Similar. Very deserving of being their own characters. Yeah, archetypes, archetypes. Got you. All right, so um, yeah, we're seeing Lucas get back to stage using the snake instead of the uppy, which is a lot safer. Actually, that's huge. I didn't think about that. That's probably better. Oh, so yeah, because Ness doesn't have that, right, exactly, the the range grab. Again, Ness and Lucas have super strong throws, and the range on that grab using Lucas, maybe that is going to be the difference maker here. He's going to get more grabs because he has range. Um, but See, yeah. She's she's abusing T-Jolt. She's being able to get in with T-Jolt uh, quick attack. Right, he the one thing that you should be able to do it, in this yeah. matchup, right? Yeah, so, I mean, until Flux shows that, you know, he has a matchup knowledge to counteract that, she's going to keep doing it. And Mizik... He's done it before. I know he knows he can do it, All right. but he might not think it's that important. So we'll see how this works out for him. Uh, he can he also do it there with the, the lightning. Oh, true. Yeah. I didn't think. Wait, that catches? Even yep. though the lightning goes yep. all the way because it's a projectile. Got you. And again, like you were saying, so switching over to Lucas, you get a lot more grabs because you have range, and his first kill comes off of a grab. Um, but again, Mizik was down in the previous game as well. You know, didn't Swing. let it lateral, and she ran it back anyways. And here we go again. You know, just not panicking. Just doing I like your that thing. baiting him. That's right. probably what he's afraid of. He's afraid of getting baited. Right, and getting stuck with the side beat yeah. and punished afterwards. I got you. But um, yeah, again, Mizik not really panicking. So what if I lost the stock? Like I've got you That'll clearly hit. at kill nice. percentage. <laughs> oh, no punish on the regrab. All right. Okay. Am I audible? Perfect. I am. I'm sorry for being really loud there for a second. You're pretty loud. What's good, Vanilla? Am I good now? Level's fine. Uh, a little bit lower. 
A little bit lower. All right, we're we're back. We're back. There we go. So I, I just I just feel the need to say this to the I don't care if it's the three people listening or the any people who go back and watch this vod. Hey, come on. This Ho is the most popular. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This is a debate that goes around so much, and I really I really want to set the record straight. Okay. Go ahead. On game two, it is stage first, character second. Yes. That was the dispute that was happening. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um, I, I think a lot of people get mixed up with stuff like that and, uh, mm -hmm. you know, like how it's backwards for game one. Right. That, yeah. that, that, is, that is a PSA that I will always take the time to, like, tell people. Because it, it really sucks when you just don't know the order of it and then halfway through a set you're like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're very lucky to have such knowledgeable and, you know, I integrity-driven TOs such as Vanilla here. I at mean, Sandy. he's right, though, but nobody does that. <laughs> nobody does that. He's absolutely correct. <laughs> that is the rule, but I've never done it. <laughs> 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 I know the rules, but I don't really follow them. <laughs> I get to claim, um, you know, like ignorance. Like I literally didn't know that you was didn't a thing. Know that? It's I didn't on know the sheet. A... Who reads the sheet? I read the sheet. Why would you read the sheet? <laughs> <laughs> Again, I've been coming here since Grind sixty eight. Uh, my apologies to Flux and Mizik. They're probably watching this back in the future, thinking, "Where is the oh, commentary yeah. on how I get better?" You jerks are, <laughs> we have are talking about. We ignored their game. <laughs> Let's get back <laughs> into it. Things. It's but, a um, tight game. It's a tight game. They're both down to two socks. Uh, percentage is relatively even. Oh, oh but yeah. Lucas got way too aggressive on stage. I don't know what happened there. Stage. Did you see yeah, what happened? Um, like, he connected with his, his upbeat, but, yeah, he Did went he under the stage. the stage. It might have been, yeah. I think his angle was just a little bit too yeah. low. So now we're seeing both characters playing the spacing game, dashing in and out. Um, so yeah, if you're a Mizzic, this is... I'd, I'd just sit back. Yeah, right, and this is time to spam that T-Jolt that Lucas has not been punishing you for. Like he has Especially if you're at 0%, what's the risk? Yeah, exactly. And they got more hits. He tried to throw it out there, and there he finally go. gets some health back. All right, so now if you're Mizzic, it's like, all right, well, that moves off the board. I got to think of something else. Uh, not the end of the world. Uh, but yeah, it's it gotta is, be hard it's for Flux tool. to connect any of his normals. I don't, I don't play either of the uh, Earthbound brothers, but like I can't imagine landing fair on Pika in neutral. <laughs> I think it's bad enough landing wolf, <laughs> wolf normals <laughs> on Pikachu. Uh, but yeah, you clearly uh, lots of Pikachu matchup models. Oh yes, training I do. Partner, big big Pikachu big player. Big Pikachu player. Yeah. Uh, that's the only reason I know that fact is because <laughs> he complains about Ness. <laughs> Ness is a 60-40 in his yeah. uh, on his book. Exactly, but you know, exactly. Come on down to Xanadu, meet people, learn yep. matchups, have a good time, forge yep. great friendships. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> like me, <laughs> Mizik doing a really good job of just like extending the survivability on this second stock. Uh, yeah, making Flux really work for, it, but at the same time not racking up too much extra credit Flux until so that much conversion trouble right anything. there. Yeah, uh, but yeah, and again, this is when it gets dangerous if you're Flux. I, I've got to get this second stock off before I worry about the last stock. And Pikachu it's only was 10% from max rage, but he took it off the board. It's only minute 30 left. You can camp this out. That's not out of the question. I and mean, I think she is. I mean, that would be, you know, the smart thing to do. People might call it lame, but, you know, nah, like we're, take the w. Exactly, we're here to get dubs. Come and, on, yeah, we're looking yeah. at a solid, Don't what, 70 seconds left? But never mind, she's not hanging back at all. She's racking up damage past I plus don't like at over 100. I don't like swinging for that. <laughs> That's swinging for the fences. There you go. You know, she's here to give the three people watching the show. I'm not going to run around. The 800,000 <laughs> watching right yeah. now. Like, I'm going to go for broke, and, like, I'm going to earn this win. I'm going to get this kill. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, she still has a solid Ooh. lead if she decides to change up her game plan, 60%. Yeah. But, yeah, like she said, putting on a show for the people, goes aggressive, gets the final kill with 43 seconds left. Uh, so, Mizik goes 2-0, correct? Right? She didn't yep, drop a game, right? So 2-0 and glides right on into in a tough matchup, redemption too. winners finals. So if I'm correct, that is your next opponent, right? Sure is. All right. So are we getting winners finals next? Mizik, very, very happy, <laughs> very proud of herself, as she should be. Um, yeah. So yeah, we've got, we've got. Uh, He'll just yank me off commentary if I'm up next. Oh right. no, wait, we're not because we got to do flux and. Oh, no, no, wait, he just went. Are we doing all of top eight? So, yeah, we're going to dip down into loser side. We'll see. Vanilla running back. Oh, nope, and nope, yep. Poe is up. All right. So. Had a feeling. All right, but you, you got to you got to watch your opponent. Yeah, you I know, mean, Pikachu. I labbed him out. I'll probably lose because I, <laughs> I think her neutral is really good. But, uh, you know, crazier things yeah. have happened. So, 
We're about to see what's going to happen. So in all likelihood, we're going to get a Pikachu Best wolf luck, battle. Hey, you think I could get? I think I'm going to go try to get uh, Nathan on board to try to commentate, commentate as well. Yeah. Like, all right. Uh, well, we got to be quick about it. But that was yeah. probably going to yank you if you're not fast. All right. Yeah.